Now, welcome back to the second part of the Imperial March. And we'll start off with a little mystery for you. Um, now, listen to that one. And you might want to think about it for the duration of the video. And I'll tell you what it was in the end. And here's how I did it. First and foremost, I have to give credits for all the artwork to Andre Tagliati. I hope I got that name right. He's written an Arduino script that uh, has all the the logic in it that I needed. I simply converted it uh, to this Lua script, and well, that that basically was all there was to it. Add a piezo buzzer to uh, GPIO2. And I'll just show you very quickly how I did it. Of course, we need the serial adapter to program it, the module itself, a resistor, well, just to be on the safe side, and the piezo buzzer. You're ready to upload the code, of course. It'll only take a second to upload. It's, it's not big, really. Uh, I've, I've got it published on my blog, and if I go do file and execute it, it'll just play the Imperial March. Right, back to our mystery signal. Now, what was it? I had reused that module from an earlier project, and I had it running in soft AP mode. And you heard those 10 ticks a second, and that was actually the beacon signal. Uh, the Wi-Fi module sending out the SSID uh, 10 times a second for the clients to pick, up, to pick up. And that apparently caused a bit of a drop in the voltage um, that came out of uh, the GPIO pin. And, well, that's what we heard. So, bye for now.